Coming off two big wins against LMU and Pepperdine, the Pilot men are eager to continue their run, with Gonzaga coming to the Child Center this Thursday. It was a close game in Malibu last weekend as the Pilots took on the Waves. The nail-biter came down to the wire, with Alec Wintering putting the Pilots ahead with a late three, followed by Jarrell Marshall making a huge block, holding off Pepperdine and securing a 73-70 Pilot win. In addition to the game-winning block, Marshall also contributed 14 points in 12 rebounds for his first career double-double. The team next headed to LA as they faced the Lions. Demarcus Tyson had yet another huge game from beyond the three-point line, scoring six threes. The team's dominant rebounding and three-point game helped them sail to a 92-78 victory. After the exciting weekend, junior Alec Wintering has been named WCC Player of the Week and has been receiving national attention. The point guard was able to contribute 29 points in the victory against LMU and 19 against Pepperdine, making him the leading scorer in both games. Through the hands of Cameron Edwards, Alec Wintering off to the races. What are the keys to winning Thursday's game? Uh, I think just coming out with energy. Um, doing a great job on defense. They have two great players. So we just need to come out with energy, be prepared for what they're going to bring. Here comes Alec Wintering in a two-on-one. Jazz Johnson and Portland reclaims the lead. How has the team grown since facing Gonzaga earlier this season? Um, we've made a lot of adjustments. Um, we did not play well against them at Gonzaga, and, and we looked at film and studied them, and we're definitely more prepared this time than we were last time. Demarcus Tyson from way out there. Third three for Demarcus Tyson. We have like a little bit of a mojo going, and um, we just uh, have the confidence that we didn't really have the first time that we can beat better teams in the conference. What kind of influence does having a sold out crowd bring to this game? Oh, it brings a lot of energy and whenever we have energy in the building, we do well. So it'll be fun. Marcus Tyson, top three, got it. Gonzaga has experienced some upset so far this season, including a loss to BYU just two days before the Pilots beat the Cougars 84-81. The last time the men were able to upset the Zags was at home two years ago. The same year, the team had a triple overtime victory against BYU. The team faces top WCC competitor Gonzaga in the Child Center Thursday, February 11th at 8 p.m. The matchup will be broadcasted live on ESPNU.